All right, my quick video, I am on my way to the gym currently, but I've had a few people within the community ask and talk about how, uh, you know, the biggest thing that they're suffering with is belly fat, right? And they're struggling to get rid of belly fat. So in this video, I wanna just talk a bit about how to go about getting rid of that problem, right? Because it is such a big problem. And that's initially what spurred me on my journey, right? Initially what spurred me on my journey of working on myself, developing my discipline, getting rid of the negative habits, and actually just like giving a shit about my life <laughs> and, and really moving forward and pushing myself was the fact that I took a picture on an island in Florida and I just did not, I just, I, I had too much belly fat, bro. And my arms were like skinny and I hated the way that I looked in that photo. And that pain is really what motivated me to actually move forward and, and to get ready to change. And of course, you know, you're always online, you see all the influencers and you know, all the, uh, all the influencers and stuff, you know, with their shredded, you know, ripped physiques and stuff. So that's always a motivating factor, especially, you know, uh, for young men. So how do we actually go about doing this? Well, I've talked about it plenty of times before and it's pretty simple, but I'm just going to give a quick rundown just in case. Let me turn a little bit to the side here, just in case you guys need a little reminder. Okay. So when it comes to belly fat specifically, or just fat on your body, there's, you can't like target a specific area and burn fat in a specific area. It doesn't work that way. Like you probably, like, I don't know if you know this, you might not know this, but like you can't burn fat in a specific area. Your body will burn fat and start to shred fat from every like part of your body. And over time, your stomach fat, your belly fat will slowly reduce, right? So you can't target a specific area. Like if you go train ab exercises right now, you start lifting or you start um, doing cable crunches, leg lifts and all these things to build your ab muscles. That's going to do nothing at all in terms of getting rid of fat. It's not gonna do a damn thing. Because the thing that everyone gets wrong is they think they need to spend more time in the gym. It's not about spending more time in the gym. It's not about going into the gym and, and working six, work out six days a week. I do that because I'm a fucking maniac and I like to you know stay just always kind of on the move in terms of doing some type of exercise every day. But it's not about being in the gym, bro. What it is about is actually hitting your macros. Hitting your macros, hitting your protein every day hitting your deficit every day. So obviously you wanna put yourself in a calorie deficit, meaning you wanna be at like 250 to 500 um, under your maintenance. Now, the reality is, you know, if you're really trying to lose some weight quick, you can even bump that up to somewhere between 500 and 1,000 in a deficit. I've done that before. Um, that, that'll get you going really quick. But that's what you need to do. And once you do that and you start to, to lift at the same time, because you want to be, you want to keep lifting. You don't want to just, if, if you just go into a big deficit to lose belly fat, okay. And you're in a deficit of say 500 calories, let's just say 500. It's about a pound a week. You're going to eventually start cutting, 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 cutting. And what's going to happen is you will get to the point where you're skinny, right? You don't want to just be skinny. You want that ripped lean look, right? You want that look because it's the most attractive, it makes you feel the most confident when you're out on the beach or just in the mirror. Every, no guy just wants to be skinny, right? You want to be ripped. You want to be low body fat, but have muscle on you. So you need to be working out two or three days a week is fine. Full body, you know, you can do four days a week, upper, lower split. It doesn't really matter, guys. It's not a big deal. You just need to be lifting weights. It can be a home gym. It can be um, act, the actual gym. Like I'm about to head to the gym right now. I don't have a home gym. I live in an apartment. It doesn't really matter what it is, okay? That's what you need to do. You need to get yourself in a deficit. You need to start lifting and you need to hit every single day. You need to hit your macros. But here's the problem, bro. Here is the real issue. It's not about this because you've probably heard this information before, right? You've probably heard this information before. Why have you not gotten the result yet? Why are you not where you want to be? Why are you still looking for the answer? The reason is because you have a lack of discipline. You have a lack of habits. If you were doing what I told you in this video to do, and you're doing it every single day, you would already be where you wanna be, or you'd be moving so fast and making so much progress so quickly, you wouldn't even second guess, you wouldn't even really need to watch a video like this. So here's the thing, if you want to actually get locked in, you wanna actually start losing belly fat, you wanna actually get that ripped physique, especially because it's still summer, you need to take action. You need to stop like procrastinating and thinking, oh, I'm gonna just do it later, Oh, well today, I'm not gonna worry about it today because what's gonna happen is you're gonna get to next year. You're gonna get to another year and then it's just gonna be another year of you looking the same, another year of your life being the same and another year of you feeling the same. 
Like this is what people do. They just, they, they put, they set goals and then they just, oh yeah, 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 I'll, I'll hit that later. They get distracted. And I was talking about this on my Instagram stories today. That's what people, that's what happens. And you just go year by year by year and year. And the problem with this is that in your subconscious mind, right? Your self image, what the, the way you see yourself, if you continuously say you're gonna do something and continuously want something, tell other people around you you're gonna do it. You know you wanna do it and you don't do it, you're telling your subconscious mind, basically you're not worthy of those results. You're training your subconscious mind to say, oh, well, yeah, we say stuff, but we don't actually do it. And that is a very scary thing. You do not wanna be in that position. So the best way for you to fight this is to take this information I'm telling you and take immediate action. Go download my fitness pal, start to track your macros, make sure you're in the deficit and hit it every single day. It's not that complicated, but I can tell you this, but 99% of people aren't gonna actually go do it. And the reason is because they don't have the discipline to actually follow through, to build the habit of actually doing it. That's why I have the coaching program. That's why I do coaching at all. That's why coaching exists. It's so that you can stay accountable. So someone can hold you accountable. Someone can guide you through all the mistakes, all the pitfalls that you're going to make along the way, collapse that time frame into a shorter um, time frame, and actually get you results and help you build the habits, guide you along the path. That's what it's all about. See, for me, on my journey to, you know, I, I think I cut like over 20 pounds while putting on muscle at the same time. Um, and from my journey and my experience, it took me literally longer than a year. Okay, it took me over a year. It was taking me like getting close to like years and years and years of time. And the reason for that was because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. I thought I knew what I was doing, but I had no idea what I was doing. And so when you have someone by your side to actually guide you through the process, it's just gonna go so much quicker. So that's why instead of it taking you years to get to this point, you can do it within 90 days. I offer the 90 day transformation, I hold you accountable, we get your macros locked in, we get your habits locked in, we get you off the vices and the negative bad habits that are going to derail you. That's another aspect that people don't talk about. They're like, oh yeah, just, just get in a deficit and just cut. Okay, what about the fact that you're gonna be consuming alcohol or weed, which is gonna lead you to binge to other food because you're keeping an instant gratification mindset. People think it's just as simple as, oh, just get yourself in a deficit and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay, that might work for some people, but the vast majority of people, that's the reason why the vast majority or the majority of Americans today are, are obese, are, they're obese. They don't actually take their health seriously. Don't, they don't take their daily habits seriously and they think that they're doing the right thing, but they haven't considered all these other factors. So that's the step-by-step -step of what to do to lose belly fat. You just get yourself in that deficit, okay? You focus on hitting your protein and your macros. You focus on training in the gym two to three days a week, four days, if you can do that, that's awesome. And you work on getting rid of all the things that are gonna be holding you back, the junk food, the alcohol, the weed, the porn, anything that leads to an instant gratification mindset or is high dopamine will help you stay more consistent, okay? You don't have to do that, but it will help you stay more consistent along your path. If you need help on this process, click the link in the description, book a call with me. We'll talk about your goals. We'll see where you're at. We'll see if it makes sense. And you can hop on, get this done in 90 days instead of like it taking two or three years, right? Because a lot of people drag this out way longer than it needs to be. Even a year is way too long. It, it doesn't need to be that long. You can get locked in way sooner than that. Also, the other thing is I've got the free community. You can hop in there, go through this step-by-step -step guide. That might even help you a bit more if you're looking for that. But that's basically it, man. That's all you got to do is just follow through with the steps that I told you. If you're still struggling with belly fat, I understand the pain of it because I've also struggled with it. Nothing crazy. Like I was never like super, super, super overweight, but enough to where it affected me negatively in my mind and my confidence and just spiritually, mentally, and physically, I was not in a good place. So that's it, bro. Stay consistent, but down in the comments if there's anything else you want to add to the conversation or any ideas to help out the rest of the people who are suffering with this problem. And uh, let's just get this fixed because it's really not something that men should really be dealing with in 2024. There's no excuse with the information and the resources that are available. All right, that's it. Signing off. Going to go hit the gym. Peace.